Hello and welcome back to Brief Edge. I am still looking for a way out. Thank you. We need to be careful. We don't know how many of these coffin bots are left here. That's why I have my pew pew blaster. These are old preservation capsules. They seem to contain the entire crew of this station. Wait, which ones? Oh, these. Oh. This one seems to be the capsule for you. How terrible! They Aww. preserve corpses right in their spacesuits. I wouldn't want to be stuck here with your body for 40 years. Okay. The equipment is badly damaged. Even gravity has been disabled. At least the oxygen generators are working. By hmm. the way, how do you connect to them so quickly and imperceptibly on any debris? This is starting to raise questions. What in the world is this? Something was being assembled here. Or someone was being disassembled. Oh. Okay, we'll have to make something. Probably. No, this is too much. Apparently, we did find Babe. Oh. It looks like this is the only way out of here. I can see Normandy. I don't recommend flying too far from the station. We still need to find the control center, and we can't get into Normandy from outside. Okay, I guess we have to go through this giant hole. That's not that big after all. It looks like some kind of technical corridor. I hope we can get to the control center from here. I still can't believe that the Breath Edge Agency is directly involved in all this. If the robot hasn't lied to us, we need to send the compromising evidence before the massive attack begins. Otherwise, there will simply be nowhere to go back. I think there should still be some transmitting systems near the core, and for the sake of saving the galaxy, I would strongly recommend using them before we attempt to activate the warp jump. Okay, okay. Oh, hurry. Such prohibited. This place seems familiar. Isn't it where the coffin bots interrogated you? Yes. It looks like the guards died without our help. Lucky us. Wait, where is this supposed to be? This is not Monday. Right, here they Looks are. like we found one of the station's control centers. We could have figured out it was here. believed it was real. I'll take this as a souvenir. I defeated not just someone, but the main one. And that's something to be proud of. I think this sign was made by the robots themselves. It's a wonder that their outdated artificial intelligence has managed to develop into pure creativity. Hmm. Oh, here. Seems like the main systems are still working. Unlike the two bads, the coffin was connected to the control center and it burned out along with all the connectors on the panel. I can't connect directly to it, but with your help, I can try to do it through the robot itself. Okay. Uh, oh, so true. Just try to saw it as quietly as you can. They're probably looking for us. Alright, now switch that little receiver over there. Done! I've connected to- No, 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 no! Oh, it's rusty! Ugh, disgusting! Alright, I- uh, well, I'm ashamed to admit, but the robot no longer has a direct connection to the station. 
but it still has an unencrypted cache block where I saw the most disgusting moments of this coffin bot's life. I also found the passwords for the doors and magnetic airlocks, but still, the absolute quantity of that abhorrent data was overpowering. We can go back to Normandy. Okay, if you say so. Of course, it's not open. You lied to me. Um... It's through here, I think. Just be as quiet as possible. Something's wrong. I think they're waiting for us behind the next door. It's too quiet. Be extra cautious. Okay. Didn't they launch? Ready your weapon. Ready? It's about to get hot. I'm going to melt under this stress. It looks like they're too smart. I think they've set up an ambush right outside Normandy. The coast is clear. They're trying to lure us into the shuttle. This isn't good. Try not to damage the shuttle if shooting starts. That's it. This is the end. They're on the captain's bridge. I don't know what to do. We're trapped. Uh, where's the ambush? Did I turn on the suspenseful music for nothing? Ah, never mind. It's time for us to leave. Clearance for departure received. There's only one step left. The coffin bots wanted to connect the core directly to the ship with the mother station, and we need to do something similar with Normandy. It will require a huge amount of energy to travel on the pleasure shuttle to the habitable sectors, and, as I've already mentioned, the core can give us that. If we're faster than the core exploding, of course. Of course. And yes, since there is no babe, we must... What? What? I can see the signal has improved. Shepard, did you remove the interception equipment? I'm running out of oxygen. The robots are everywhere. Harp, I'll try to it do everything. It can't be. We saw the robots die. We won't fall for this a second time because... Hey, easy there. You'll make me re... Could you be more careful? We almost crashed. You won't fall for the same bait again, will you? We need to send the compromising evidence all over the galaxy and connect to the core without blowing ourselves up. We don't have time for non-existent survivors. Um, we do. Captain Shepard's autopilot is still active. I hope it will simply turn off when the systems reboot. Otherwise, I won't be able to change the route for the warp acceleration. Okay, I think... Oh, this is it. The core. the core. Let's forget about Babe for a second. We need to look around. <laughs> Normandy, are you that close? I'm too slow. I'll send you the coordinates, but you must be careful. There are many robots here. Are there? Right! And one of these robots is sending us messages. By the way, she doesn't have that awful accent anymore. I know, right? <laughs> Careful, all the data on the core is classified, and I have no idea where we're going. I've connected, and it alarmed them. Be careful. I feel like we're in the middle of a conversation. Maybe each of the seen a ship like this. It looks like the coffins were going to use it to connect the core to the mother station, or they are still going to do it, judging by their activity. I've never realized how incredible an artificial intelligence must be to control an entire galaxy of coffins. Hmm. You 
can dock to this spaceship. Okay. The airlock is asking for access codes, and it's using foul language. This is the first time I've seen an airlock with an artificial intelligence, but it's clearly not happy with us. I don't care. We made it very angry by docking without clearing. You should have heard all those expressions. The airlock hates us to the core. I can see you. Start a connection and I'll try plan B. Start the connection? Plan B? I like charades. A charging station for old battery powered types of spaceship. If we can build a voltage transmission unit based on this station, we can power Normandy without melting its plating. Should I do this first or. What an interesting place. Start the connection, she said. I have a crazy idea, but first let's take a look around. Right, this spaceship is definitely connected directly to the core. I can't help thinking that we can use this if we put together a stabilizing unit. Okay. An ideal place for a diverting unit. Probably. Try switching that red lever over there. Yes, everything is perfect. We can connect Normandy to the core via this spaceship and activate the warp jump if we find the control post. Then we will only have to... Wait, don't you think the camera's behavior is strange? It looks like it's focusing on the airlock on purpose as if a mob of aggressive robots is about to... Oh. Oh, my. Did I do this? Did I learn to see the future and shoot lightning? I had no doubt that I was a genius. Are you alright? I saw a large cluster of robots near Nomadi and activated the power cable at the Why airlock. Why does she keep interrupting me? Although this time I'm even grateful to her. Perhaps this coffin has become so used to playing the role of a woman that it really decided to help us. Let's connect Normandy quickly and get out of here. Just so need to install all those, okay. Voltage transmission to magnets to alkali to electrons for resin. To aluminium to plastic to thick tape. back in place and we'll forget about this incident please put, please put the core back in place and we'll forget about this incident that's weird why did I start talking okay I don't think I have any no so I need one generator and one in the turret metal plastic Compensator. Alkali electronics to metal. Okay. And done. This unit won't last long, but we don't need it to. One electrical impulse to the core of Normandy will be enough. Mm -hmm. 
Good. With this unit, we'll have a chance of not being fried along with Normandy. Yay. Perfect. If I've calculated correctly, this unit will be able to divert the excess power away from Normandy. What now? Everything is ready. I can see the model station is losing power, so you're done now. Go to the control center. I'll meet you at airlock 5A. I'm wearing a pink spacesuit. I get the feeling this message is incomplete. I still don't trust her, of course, but we probably don't have much choice. Where's this airlock 5A she mentioned? I hope we destroyed all the coffins when we came here. I wouldn't fly there without Normandy. You wouldn't? This way, apparently. Hey, so true. No one's here to meet us. Neither in a pink spacesuit nor in any other one. Oh, they will It looks like a technical exit for servicing the liner's plating. Let's be careful this time. I don't want to get hit on the helmet with stick again. What a strange place to meet. Can we go back? No, no, no. Back is the other way. I don't like this at all. Neither do I. These seem to be the personnel cabins, not the control center. That's strange. The personnel were obviously killed a long time ago. Who was shooting who then? Is this Babe? Or is she over there? There are too many Babes here. They were obviously interested in this cabin. survivors here. These are obviously handmade control and communication panels. Can you connect me to them? Sure, go ahead. Interesting. You can control some of the remaining systems of the liner, including communication points. There's a lot of technical data on the core, on the module plans, and even access codes to secret compartments. Great! I'll upload the compromising evidence and try to send it via all available communication channels of the liner. And then let's find the control center. Compromising evidence uploaded successfully. I hope someone receives the signals. Hair over. Okay. Wait. Long hair is often a source of increased contamination of the filtration systems on spaceships. An extinct mammal of the Lagomorpha order. Unfortunately, it's not possible to determine the genus and species. Apparently, the cabin's owner was the chief specialist of the core stabilization. It was a woman, judging by the handwriting. Judging by the plans, we need to go through that door. It looks like all the coffins ran there. So the access code is... Hmm... 4498983PI. What are P and I? What's PI? Punch it? Maybe. I was just kidding. PI stands for password input, but never mind. Now we should definitely be more careful. It's not clear where all this mob of coffins ran, who Babe is, what awaits us in the control center, and when all of this will be over. Why there so many rooms in here? They were killed recently. Someone is a good shot and knows their weaknesses. Intruders on level one. Terminate. Is this about us? Wait, no. We're on level five. Intruders on level five. Terminate. Now this is definitely about us. We're gonna Watch guns. the turret. Oh. Automatic plasma guns on board a spaceship. It's not wise to have them, even in a top secret facility. Right. We need to go right. No, wait. 
I don't know. I don't have any navigator functions. Just a coordinate grid. Right. So we're going left. Because it doesn't matter. I'm so tired of you cockroaches. You've destroyed everything that has taken years of work to create. You are a virus. Did the door close by itself? Mm -hmm. This doesn't make sense, but it's very interesting. Break it down. Why are you so interested in this spacesuit? You're a creation of breath age. Why are you interfering in the natural course of events? It sounds like that insane diagnostic station that was trying to get on our radio frequency. Insane? What do you consider insanity? Isn't it insane to blindly reject ideas you don't understand? Breath Edge strives for balance, and you only create chaos using outdated norms of society. The only one who's insane here is you. I didn't understand anything, but we need to be careful. Yeah. Careful. Sure. going through. I don't have any more blasters. Yep. Your attempts to change something are futile. The war has already started, and you can't stop Breath Edge. I've already heard it somewhere. Ah, oh, yes, from those TV-faced coffins. Is this really the mother station they were so eager to connect? TV-faced coffins? You don't even understand their idea, their genius, and practicality. Don't answer it. Just keep quiet. Come to think of it, can you talk at all? I don't think so. Person bow for high precision work in hard to reach places and in low visibility conditions. 20 kilowatts, a stabilizing head, and an asynchronous basher. I wonder what this is. Wow, what a tool! I won't give you the manual for it, of course, because we still need your hands intact. However, if you found it at the beginning of our adventure, we'd have crafted a new liner with it. Great. Think about how much garbage humanity creates and how irresponsibly it wastes resources. You are ready to burn your dead bodies, preserve them in zinc coffins, and even throw them into space for the sake of fashion. You've destroyed millions of species and created synthetic life. You need to change, and Breath Edge will help you. No, thank you. Maybe it might help, but we're already close to the control center. Get out of here. It's starting to panic, and I can't see robots anywhere. I hope they all got stuck somewhere in the textures. Mm -hmm. Something's happening. Okay, but I think I'm gonna start here. And I'm gonna leave the end for tomorrow. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon.